Today I show you how to enable in-app purchases if you are trying to make a purchase in one of the apps, for example Roblox, and the purchase doesn't work. You might have a setting on screen time and you, I will show you now how easy it is to disable the setting to allow in-app purchases. But you should only do this when you need to install an app that is paid or when you need to install you should only do this when you need to actually make a purchase in an app, an in-app purchase, and not by accident. To enable in-app purchases, you go into the settings app, and in the settings, you could check for screen time, and here, go through content and privacy restrictions, and then app installations and purchases. Here, you can check if in-app purchases are allowed, and also if required password is always required or don't require. I really suggest to keep it with always required so you're sure you want to install the purchase in a purchase you want and you can allow in a purchases like that. In this way you can make a purchase in an app but it will have to be verified with your password. This is the safer way I believe. This is the safer way I believe and this is after you add your card number to your Apple account and everything else is set up your Apple account, your App Store you, you go to the App Store and you see all the apps and you can, this is after This is after you add your card number to. this is after you add your billing information to the App Store and you install apps and still then you have a problem but it's not working the step for to check this with screen time is actually one of the most useful steps where you can enable and disable the in-app purchases. So you can use screen time to disable in-app purchases until it's time to enable them. You make the purchase and you put it back how it was. After you make your purchase, you go back to screen time and you set it back to not allow. After you make your purchase, after you make your purchase, you can go back in the settings and scroll all the way down to screen time then content and privacy restrictions, app installation and purchases, install, installing apps. Here you can choose not to allow in-app purchases after you finish with the purchase that you made. I hope this helps you do the in-app purchases you want to and not more. Thanks for watching.